normal life, the Division of Rehabilitation and Crippled Children's Services could be the link to a better life. Vocational rehabilitation is designed to solve or help the specific employment problems of a disabled individual. Services are available to those persons 16 years of age and over who have a physical or mental disability which results in a handicap to employment. Should you be in need of services or have questions concerning vocational rehabilitation, contact Vocational Rehab at 2419 Garden Smith Drive here in Mobile. Okay, we have a couple of calls on the line. Let's go to the line and see if we can answer these calls. Your own employment outlook. Yes, um, I'd like to say that I'm a recent high school graduate and I don't have any specific experience with employment. However, I have experience with the Department of Human Services and I would like to know if there are to find out about getting a, a job. I have no desire to go to a college right now or any other training institution. I just like to work. Okay, Ms. Simpson. Uh, my advice to you would be to uh, come in again and make out an application for and register for work. Uh, to me, it appears as if on the surface you need to talk with uh, an employment counselor uh, like myself in order that we can sit down together to discuss your interests, establish what your interests are, and uh, be able to better assist you in finding employment. And when you say she should come in and register, you mean at the State Employment Service Office? Uh, if she would like to call in to make an appointment, she may do so. Uh, but you do mean at the State Employment Service Office? At the office. State Employment Service. Okay. Thank you for your call. Thank you. Okay, we have another call on the line. You're on Employment Outlook. Yes, sir. Can an employer hire a hire disabled person? part-time on a part-time basis and work that person 40 hours a week and then tell that person they're not uh, eligible for medical insurance and paid vacations. Okay, uh, Ms. Harrell, are you going to try to answer that? Uh, now, if, if those benefits are available to... to other uh, employees have them. They are available to other employees. Right. I would think that she couldn't uh, deny you the right. If these the benefits are available to employee, other employees, then uh, the benefits should be available to the disabled worker also. Uh, let me mention since that there is uh, the regional office for this area, if you have a complaint, if you feel you've been discriminated against on a job or if there's an employee who needs some information about hiring a handicapped worker, uh, the Federal Office of Contract and Compliance for this area is in Jackson, Mississippi, and our local representative is Mr. Henry Edwards. But of course, this office is in Jackson, Mississippi. We have a telephone number that if you call our office that we will give you that you may contact this office. Okay, thank you. Thank you for your call. Okay, Ms. Harold, are there any incentives for an employer to hire uh, a handicapped individual? as far as monetary incentives or 